Hello and welcome to this clip all about accessing class charts for the first time. So, you're probably looking at this clip because you've received from the school a letter and an access code and maybe you're not sure what to do. Well, it's really simple. First of all, I'd recommend logging in for the first time on a PC or laptop or through the web browser on your phone. Do a quick search for class charts login, click on the link and if you're a parent, click on parent. If you're a student, click on student. Now, You've got the access code that we've sent. If your son's lost that, you can give the school a call and we'll happily tell you what it is over the phone. Um, but at the moment, you don't have an account yet. So when you click on I don't have an account yet, you'll see that it's going to ask you for your email address. That's your personal email address, not a school one. Put in the email address that you use most often there and there. And then once you've done that, you can enter an access code that you've been given. And then from there, your son's date of birth, your name, and then you choose a password. Once you've done that, you click login and you're good to go. You'll instantly be accessing class charts where you'll be able to see your son's homework. And this will replace show my homework. You'll be able to see your son's homework. And soon you'll also be able to see information about your son's conduct in school and any detentions that he gets and other things like that. What's also useful is that once you've signed up online, that username, or sorry, your email address and password that you've set will allow you to log into the Class Charts app. So if you have an Apple phone, if you go to the App Store on your phone, you can download the Class Charts for Parents app. And students, you can download the Class Charts for Students app. And if you have an Android phone, you can go to the Google Play Store where you can do exactly the same thing. The great thing about the app is that you'll then also get notifications and all of that kind of thing, which means you don't have to check your emails or log in to see the latest information. It will almost notify you of it as it comes in live. So that's how you get yourself signed up to Class Charts. You do a Google search or a Bing search for Class Charts login. Parents, click Parents. Students, click Students. Select the I don't have an account yet option. Put in your email address. Fill in the rest of the details, such as date of birth, your name, and the, your preferred password. Click login, and you are good to go. If you have any problems with that, please do give us a call, and we'll try to help. There are some handy guides just over here that you can access if you do get stuck or you want to know how to make the most of the service once you're in. And if your son has lost the access code for whatever reason, do give us a call, and we'll be able to tell you what that code is for you and your son just over the phone. Okay, thank you very much indeed for watching and good luck getting signed in.